This feature replaces the traditional gear shift with an electronic button or lever to make driving a little easier. Get to know how to use it in three minutes or less. If your vehicle is equipped with push or pull buttons near the infotainment screen or in the center console, depending on your model, that look like this, or a joystick style lever in the center console like this, you have electronic precision shift. For the push or pull button version, Start your engine, then with your foot on the brake pedal, shift into gear using the buttons on the gear button panel. Pull the R or D button to engage reverse or drive. The selected gear position will illuminate in red. To shift into neutral from park, place your foot on the brake pedal and then hold the neutral button until it turns red. While in drive, you can press the L button to engage low. If your vehicle is equipped with low, you can use the plus or minus buttons to limit the highest available gear. And the highest available gear will display on the driver information center. To exit low and return to drive, pull the drive button. With your foot firmly on the brake and the vehicle stopped, press the P button to shift the vehicle into park. If you have the shift lever version of electronic precision shift, it's located on the center console it has a park button at the top of the lever and a shift lock release button on the side that you need to press in order to shift gears. With your foot on the brake pedal, press and hold the shift lock release button. Push the shifter forward toward R. With your foot on the brake pedal, press and hold the shift lock release button, then pull the shifter rearward toward D. To shift into park, press the brake pedal until you come to a complete stop, then press the P button. Going downhill or towing a trailer, you can shift into L, low, to limit the top gear and vehicle speed. While in drive at a low speed, pull the shifter rearward to L. Pull the shifter rearward again to return to D to re-engage the normal shift pattern. For more information about electronic precision shift in general, please refer to your vehicle owner manual.